So, last week, Tony Mangan from MyWorldWalk.com told us about the flooding waters in Australia. So, let's find out this week, where's Tony? Walking around the world, I sometimes get quite a bit of female attention. Oh, hello. Okay, girls. I got to move on. What did I say? Hello. I'm uh, Alan Austin. I saw you on the road two days ago. You're about uh, 70 or 80 k south of here. I'm just going to offer you a bottle of water. We're nearly, we're, we're nearly in for Alabama. Thank you so much, thank you so much. You're, it's amazing. And sorry, what did you say your name is again? Alan Austin. Alan? And Jocelyn. Ah, Jocelyn. Thank you so much. You're, you're very, very kind. You're very, very kind. And thank you for the water. No worries thank at all. You. How am I feeling? I see I'm feeling great. As you can see, I can do all the shave. It's pretty warm today, it's about 24 degrees. Uh, that's what it says on my thermometer, but to be honest with you, it seems a lot more than that. I'm, it's, um, it's hot, it's muggy, it's humid. To be honest with you, I never use air condition. No matter how hot it is, I've, I've been, I've gone into hotels when it's 50 degrees and the first thing I did was turn off the air condition. I literally, to train myself not to, to be reliant too much on air condition and uh, it seems to work I can walk along the road and it's hot because I don't have air conditioning on the road hey here's a shady tree just in time for lunch but hey the vice from within is asking Tony you don't do air condition why select a shady tree for lunch well I'm not stupid Go for a walk, girls. More than 11 months between Australia and New Zealand. I never got this close. Oh, should I go? So, now that Tony has found his attractions, let's find out where Tony will be over Easter. Thanks for watching and join us when we look at Tony Mangan's MyWorldWalk.com adventures next week.